Hello everyone and welcome. In this video, I want to show you how to create collections and how to properly set them up. This will be the smart way of organizing your collections. So all you have to do is go in your admin panel, click on products and then collections. Let's assume you have no collections right here. So just click create collection. You have to give it a title. Depending on the channels you have available, being your online store, your point of sale, your uh, Facebook, Instagram, all of that, you can manage where to show the collection. If it's available everywhere, it's visibility. So you can just check here and that's done. You can put a description for your collection. You can add an image depending if your team will show the collection image or not on your store. Guys, I have a special offer for you. Just let me pause the video for a few seconds. If you're interested in, in having a one hour consultation with me and five hours worth of free work on your Shopify store, this is all value at $575. It's, it's pretty simple. All you have to do is subscribe to my channel, like this video and comment in the comment section below. And you have the chance to be one of the winner each month. So please do that and Let's continue the video. Collection type, you have manual and automated. I'll strongly advise against using manual. Uh, in most of the cases, that doesn't make any sense. You should go with automated. The big advantage of automated is that it the collection will grow as your store grows. So maybe you start with just four or five products, but if in a year you have 50 products, you don't have to always make changes to your collection to add the new products. So the smart way of doing this is creating conditions. The way conditions work is that you set conditions for each collection. And if a product match that condition, it will be added to this collection you have different type of conditions. So it can be the product title, the product type, product vendor, product price, product tag, compare at price, weight, inventory stock, and the variant title. Let's go with something simple. If you have a product type, you can then select it's equal to, not equal to, this is your logic. So you have different logics that you can use starts with and with contain does not contain so whatsoever let's go with the first one and t-shirt so test collection this should be t-shirt so what i want to do instead of me manually adding all my t-shirts i'm creating a condition so the product type should be equal to t-shirts and this will add all products that match this condition we can do save so the collection has been created and you can see right here that the products have been automatically added to the collection. So if you remove a product or you add a product in the future that has the same conditions as this collection, it will be automatically added to this collection. So it's pretty simple and this is the smart way of creating and managing your collections. The products, you can also set how to sort them. You can sort them by best selling from product title or highest price, lowest price, newest, whatever you want. You can also go manually and then you will have the option to drag and drop each of the product if you don't have too many. If you have 50 products, I you shouldn't do that. Then just sort it automatically by one of these options. And to not forget, you can also edit your website SEO. It will be good to have a good page title with keywords or also and also add a description. And maybe you can have some more keywords in your URL. You can just add here it, each keywords that you want to use like this. Your collection will have more chance of ranking on Google. So this is it. It should be pretty simple how to create collection in your store. If you have any questions, please ask them in the comments below. Don't forget to choose to use automated condition and you can have more than one condition at a time and your product can match any condition or all condition that's up to you.
So this is it. If you if you have any questions, please use the comments below the video to ask me anything you want to know about this video, about this process. I will uh, I will take the time to answer. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe and comment in the video. I will draw for free one hour consultation and five hours worth of work time valued at five hundred and seventy five dollars each month. So by subscribing, liking and commenting on this video, you can win a five hundred and seventy five free value that I will draw each month. So please do that and see you next time.